Lawyer and human rights activist Dele Farotimi has reacted after an ex-user claimed that if the former governor of Anambra State, Peter Obi, becomes the president and other performs, the Igbo people will be the first to start kicking against him. The ex-user also claimed that if President Bola Metinubu was an Igbo man, Igbo people won't support him. Here is what she wrote on her page. If Bat was an Igbo man, Igbo people will not support him. We will support a better candidate, not mining his tribe. If Bita Obi becomes the president and underperform in one year, Igbo people will be the first to attack or start kicking against him. Reacting to the claim, Dele Farotimi said, even the Yoruba people did not support President Tinubu, and that is why many people today are saying they are hungry, we are hungry. He said even in Lagos State, Peter Obi defeated, Peter Obi, uh, uh, defeated Tinubu during the election and pulled 90% of the votes casted. Here is what Dele Farotimi wrote on his official X page. Bart claims to be a Yoruba man, but the Yoruba people did not support him. We largely voted for Peter Obi. Lagos might not be a classic Yoruba state, but it is the one place where we are able to text his hypothesis and Peter Obi got over 70% of the votes. He said, and these have generated, you know, reactions from Nigerians. Okay, let's hit the news. Let's hit the comment section and hear what Nigerians have said on this. Where will he become president? Is it Burkina Faso or Benin Republic? Someone asks. Perhaps hunger might have killed you by then. But endeavor to be strong so that you can enjoy with us because it is going to be a real breakthrough. You shouldn't have opened your mouth like this. Reactions are getting tough, Nigerians. You shouldn't have opened your mouth like this here. On that delays reply because he is full of knowledge and, in essence, was saying or acknowledging the post as real and true. You both don't take nonsense. Bring Oji Kalo and the and the likes of uh, T A Oji Okorocha ETC. You will see that Igbos won't vote them. Igbos want a working government, not a tribal government, like other tribes do. I am still very surprised at the level Yoruba activities are hiding in Shambo, why Tunubu destroy the country like no other. Keep deceiving yourselves the way you, you did not support your govern, governors that turn your region to desert. If you people has not been supporting them, we your area look so backward like that. Like as I said, reactions are getting tough. Well, yes, very reasonable and the the tribalized Yoruba do not support Tenubu. Okay, guys, these are reactions from Nigerians. I believe Dele Farutimi uh, wants to clear this fact that you see what happened in 2023 presidential election is just a just a handwork of few individuals who feel that is their turn, and uh, that is it. He said because if he say all Yoruba people are now are supporting President Bola Tinubu or supported President Bola Tinubu, so how come Peter will be won in Lagos because Tinubu did not win in Lagos? You understand? So how come? That is what he's saying. So he's just trying to say that it's not all Yoruba people are supporting uh, President Bola Metinubu. He said they did not support him. 
but though hey, here he is now, he is the president of Nigeria, and hey, just like majority of Nigerians will say, it's not what we purchased for, that was what you know we we are given by the INEC. So, uh, 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 good and fine, the the election has come and gone, but the issue that is associating with the election had never gone. So, and it will not go. That is it. It will not go. Even the next generations to come, we still talk about that 2023 presidential election. We have never had such election in Nigeria before. That was the first time you understand. But you understand this people, what they did, they want Nigerians, you know, to lose interest in voting so that they will have, they will have full power, full space to manipulate everything they want to manipulate. I always tell us that you don't have to get tired. You have to keep pushing until you get it. If you, if you get tired, they will, they will, they will use that as a yardstick to do whatever they want to do. So Nigerians, we move. And hey, I believe says some majority Nigerian of, of majority of Nigerian youths are saying they will not come out again to vote just because of what happened last time. Please, we don't have to throw our voters card. We will continue to try until we get we get it. You understand? I'm dropping it, guys. Kindly drop your comments below the comment section. Thank you.